What happens after an object is selected to be exhibited in the collection gallery? The process shown in this video is an overview of what goes into bringing an object from storage to display. First, a curator chooses an object and the collections manager retrieves it from the vault. The collections manager then examines the object and confirms or adjusts its cataloging information in the museum's collections database. The title, date, medium, dimensions, and any inscriptions on the object are included. In the conservation lab, Conservators document the object's condition and determine whether any treatment is needed. For this particular box of film, there is a minor surface cleaning, adhesive and tape removal, and the addition of paper hinges to the interior to hold the box closed. Next, the object is taken to the photography studio to be photographed. The resulting digital master files, which document the object at that moment in time, are used to create files for a variety of uses, including publication and online access. For three-dimensional objects, such as this, there are four to eight angles that need to be captured to properly document the full object. When it is time for installation, preparators work with the curator to carefully place the object in a case. A label containing identifying information about the object, along with text that has been researched and written by a curator, is added next to the work. By taking these steps, we ensure every work that will be on display is documented, protected, interpreted, and prepared for you to see and enjoy in the gallery.